Sjogren's syndrome is an autoimmune disease that affects the lacrimal gland and its ability to produce and release tears. So Sjogren's syndrome patients have dry eye, but they have dry eye due to causes that are distinct from other kinds of dry eye syndrome. And so what we've been doing over many years is trying to figure out what are the disease processes that affect their secretion and also how can we diagnose and treat these patients more effectively. The study that was just published talks about some changes in the secretory processes in the glands in a model of Sjogren's syndrome, a mouse model of Sjogren's syndrome, and relates that to studies that we have validated in patients, telling us why certain proteins in the tears are affected, so uh, or increased in Sjogren's syndrome. And so by making that link, we're one step further to being able to restore that process to normality and to uh, be able to treat the changes in the tear film that are that are pathological.